Drive down some of the main thoroughfares in Broad Ripple, and what do you see? A lot of local shops and restaurants, but you look a little bit deeper and you'll see something else. Restaurants seemingly disappearing. 24 Hour News 8's David Williams here now to explain about this tonight, David. Hey guys, yeah, you know, you drive down Broad Ripple Avenue, you see some restaurants. Yes, there are some that are leaving, but quite a few restaurants are actually staying put and putting roots down right here in our neighborhoods. I talked to a man who says this is actually affecting his life. How am I going to afford my bills? How am I going to pay rent? Those thoughts swirling in Ray Stamp's mind. He lost his job after the restaurant where he worked closed their Broad Ripple location. Several high visibility spots on Broad Ripple Avenue now sit empty. Recently, Monon Food Company closed its Broad Ripple location to focus on their downtown venture. In mid September, after 10 years, Boogie Burger closed its doors for good. It all kind of hurt all, all at once. It was boogie burger go because it's right next door to us. Debbie Bosworth's family owns Luciana's restaurants. They're two years in and are putting roots down. Customer service is hard. Business can be hard, but if you know why you're there and what you're doing and if you're doing it right, um, stay the course. Staying the course is what Kilroy's is doing too. Over the years, general manager Stephen Kelly's watched neighbors come and go. A lot of growth has been downtown. I think the growth maybe should move up north a little bit towards the broader area. Kelly says this is a turning point. He points to new neighborhood apartments, others planned, and even word of more restaurants on the way. A resurgence in Broad Ripple. Broad Ripple has always been really good to us and we enjoy being here, so we're not going anywhere anytime soon. Stamp says he sees it too. He began his new job today. I think that's great. I think uh, that shows you know, quite a bit of loyalty. There's lots of places that are staples here and uh, makes Broad Ripple what it is. A place to go and grow. Now, Stam says he is learning the ropes, and he tells me he hopes to get settled into his new job pretty soon and into the future. All right, we wish him well. Uh, real quick, before we let you go, what's the, the secret to staying open in Broad Ripple? Well, I asked the people in our story that same question. They tell me that the key is good customer service, and in their case, good food, because that is what keeps people coming back to right. Broad Ripple, back to the restaurants, and basically keeps these businesses alive. We all like good food, right? We do. Yes. All right, David, thank you.